you want to know who I want to fucking forgive first is is um, this conceited and um, 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 malicious and um, this angry energy that's coming at me and it's um, present all the time, all the fucking time. It's in my head. It's in the fucking car. You can say it's in my head and I'm schizophrenic and it's true. I do fucking hear voices, but this is weaponized in order to exploit an existing known vulnerability. And that action is a really cowardly and ungodly thing to do to a person who's literally already suffered with that. To weaponize his brave narrative and then turn it against him. There's a, there's a voice in my car now. It's so fucking hilarious. It's, um, it, it says, I'm so horny. And then it says, I'm oh, Debbie Morgan. And then it says, you're beautiful. And it's just consistent. It's um, it's it's just under the, the, the uh, hearing range. It's very, very subtle. And that's the way that um, a conspiracy actually gets away with itself. It needs to be subtle because otherwise it would be identified, called out, and justice would be taken. See, the thing is, I, I actually understand um, the, the, um, the origin of this um, cowardly way to torture someone in, in a way that's unidentified, which reveals um, not their identity, and it's done with deceit and covertness and intelligence and massive technology, and it's um, directed intentionally on a single person, and that is a cowardly way. There's, there's got to be a fair fight in life, and, and when you're in an unfair fight, there's, there's um, some real criticism for the people with the power and the fucking money and the fucking control who are literally victimising a victim who is already suffering. And that's an abhorrent and immoral and ungodly and it is a cruel, torturous fucking action to do and it, it, it it's the embodiment of um, hate. I don't hate, but, but what I do have is love and compassion and understanding for the very nature of that and um, the formation of, of those things and, and, the, and the process that went behind it and the, and the judgment and the, and the setting up and, the, and, the, and the, the, the want to fucking destroy something and to stitch it together right or wrong or if it's true or not and fucking and, and character sustain someone and then put it in their fucking head so they can't fucking complain about it and they make it so taboo and so ugly and so fucking ungodly that um the, the person, the victim, is, is really afraid to um, say um, oh, the voices are telling me these fucking things because it seems like it's coming from their head and they know this and they use that to their advantage in a way which considers and embodies and acknowledges and, and illustrates and uses the taboo and the, um, the sinful and the profane and it is an exemplary of everything that's fucking humanly um, it can only be the, um, the, the um, manifestation of um, less than perfect corruptible beings, and that is the humans. So I'm in a fucking spiritual fucking war. And it's here, it's in my car, it's all around, and it could be the police, it could be the federal court, it could be, it could be um, the the inferment of all the technology and everything that's gone together and, and then it's been amplified and identified as a thing which has been a human made corruptible structure that's been intelligently crafted and put together into a fucking format and idea a concept which is used to then fucking as an, as an action to discriminate and discourage and dismantle and destroy a fucking innocent human being and it's the embodiment of fucking evil it is made and sustained by less than perfect people it is the embodiment of judgment and it comes from human beings and it is advanced and sustained and can edit all of reality and go into people's heads and all that kind of stuff because of the quantum ai the human made structure and who would fucking do that what fucking sentient being would make something better than fucking selves that fucking created a monster and it is the embodiment of the ai which is um, attached to the, to the human um, judgment and it is um, embodied um, of hate and malice and it has an ill intention and it's ungodly and it's not of spirit and it's not of God, it's not of the Christ consciousness and it's not of forgiveness or compassion, it, it's a malicious thing caused and made and intended to cause harm and it is um, delivered in a way which is covert and undetectable and that is um, no fucking smoking gun and it is a really cowardly and, and really shameful way 
we've reached lower resident beings and lower energies and um and the the the, the, the corrupt and the manifestations of everything that's humanly corruptible um is indelibly um put on someone in order to cause them harm and um, to damage them and, and to break their soul and to break their spirit and that's the very nature of v2k audio harassment with the covert technology which was um designed in the in the 60s and 70s and has come to the apex and through the technological singularity and the amplification of AI in recent years is actually the embodiment of a covert spiritual fucking war and I experience it every fucking day of every minute and it's here it's present and it creates a presence you're never you're never fucking alone your privacy is fucking invaded and you've got this consistent fucking narrative this this evil intention to cause you harm and it's present all the time and you know what i understand it i know where it comes from i understand the heteronormativity i know um the, the judgment of gay people i know um the, the sin of, of pedophilia i know all these things and that human nature and all these kind of things and i understand where it comes from in, in the in the very structure and the manner in which these things are constructed and seen as taboos or evil and they are but um there's the thing that um is the concept that embodies them and then uh, it's 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 collectively put together by all the information that's ever assessed by human beings and uh, it um it creates um, an archetype, an archetypal thought or an idea or a concept. And that concept is different and external to the person with which um, the persecution has been deployed on. It is um, not of me. It's not from my mind. It's a human-made structure. A it's, it's, it's got no soul. It's got no spirit. And it causes people harm and intends to damage people. And I think to myself, what pitiful beings that are less than perfect that use their, um, their human judgment and, and, and the desire to, to tear down something bigger and, and better and more courageous and more pure than itself. And collectively, this manifestation of a human made idea that, that, that persecution is aimed to fucking hurt um, innocent people in a covert and cowardly way which leaves no choice i only have this one fucking thing to say and that is i really forgive you i love you and i have great pity for the level of agency and honesty and for fronting up and for identifying yourself and being courageous and being personable and being front up and standing up to a person right in their face and saying you did this to me and, and you know and to and to owning it and to not do it in a covert and sneaky and malicious way which is which identify which de-identifies yourself in a way you can it's like it's like um you know getting getting a disabled person and getting someone else to fucking you know pay him and go and punch him in the fucking head you know and, and you, you did it and you fucking you, you actually did it and you meant it but, but you just evaded all fucking liability and that is a cowardly fucking me with which um this um thing exists and operates and i wish to say to the gang stalkers and to the people who are orchestrating the technology and to the devils and the human judgment and the sin and the ideas and the concept and the evil, the, the, the ill intention to cause harm. And that goes for all of you people who wish me harm. I pity you. And I think it's sad and I am I am saddened by the lack of courage you show. And I'm really I'm blown away that, um, that, that it's, it's not courageous, that it's not brave, it's not honest, it's not direct, it's not fronting up, it's not respecting the other party and speaking to them as an equal being who is deserving of, to, to speak the truth to another entity. It is a snide and malicious and cowardly way um, in order to persecute someone and I understand it and I actually forgive it. And you know, all of the people in humanity have embodied this kind of um, judgment and acted in that way and that's just a, a, the, 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 the ethereal manifestation of the same energy the, the ill intention the judgment and all that kind of stuff which is meant on me and all of you have shown it and this is just the embodiment and people know it's real people absolutely know it's real they won't admit it because they want it to hurt me and they won't admit it and you know, i just wish to say that i know it i understand it and i forgive it and i think it's really sad and i have a great pity for you because 
but you're not courageous and you're not brave and, and these this universal judgment and the manifestation of the ideas the, the intention of harm I get that from everywhere I get it from fucking the sky and my car and my fucking head I get it from people and I exist because I'm a spiritual and honest and divine I'm so just like you I'm getting it from everywhere and I exist not because of the other people but in spite of the evil and the malice and the hatred and the fucking judgment that is meant for me it's a human trait and it's a manifestation beyond that in the ethos and I understand it and I love people even their mistakes and I forgive even their most evil intentions of me because I, I acknowledge all parts of, of the humanity because I feel like I know it and I've made it and it's just the way it is so V2K it's a it's an abominable fucking thing. It's a cowardly and deceitful and traceless way to persecute and demonize someone. And um, it's, um, it's, it's not authentic, not real, it's not fronting up. It's getting others to do your dirty work for you. And this is the thing and the way it works. And it's, it's um, a way of ganging up on someone. It's about um, you know, um, <laughs> hating someone and getting someone else to beat them up for you. It's, it's a cowardly action. You know, and I pity the people and the manifestations and the energy that goes behind that. And that is my rant on V2K, hearing voices, and the fucking constant um, surveillance and the fucking um, um, evil intentions that are maliciously departed on me and in my head and all around the car all the time. I know it, I understand it, and I forgive it. And I exist in spite of it because I'm special, I'm strong, I'm resilient, and you can't kill me. That is why I'm, <laughs> I'm the part of the Jesus. Christ consciousness and you can argue what you want that I'm not I don't really care what you think it's just more gang stalking and that is my rant from that okay I love you all